everybody feels sorry for me, right? Pray for me. Man, nothing like a 12 gauge boom stick. Oh Lord. Mogo Ultra, semi automatic 12 gauge. Bad dude. What's up everybody and welcome to the dog pound i'm m dog and once again we're coming to you from our beautiful home away from home the bridgeville rifle and pistol club here in the little old town of bridgeville delaware the town that claims if you lived here you'd be home now well we're not home we're at the range this is where the business and the magic happens so that's what we're going to do but before we get into today's video, I'd really appreciate it if you'd smash that like button, share this video with a like-minded, patriotic friend or two, and then consider smashing that subscribe button so you never miss out on any new content that gets uploaded to the channel. I promise y'all that I'll keep working hard to earn your subscription, and I'll do my best to not make you regret that decision. It only takes a couple seconds of your time but it's the best way for you to show your support for what we do. And if you enjoy firearm shooting and a love for our constitutional rights and freedoms, I know you do, or you wouldn't be here right now, then you won't be disappointed. You can also follow me now over on Patreon and on Facebook at the Dog Pound with M Dog. And now I'm posting videos over on Rumble at Dog Pound with M Dog. And that's all one word, and it's spelled just like you see it right here at the bottom of your screen. Right there. Now, let's get into it. I'm starting a new little series here for home defense shotguns. And this, my friends, is the first, the first video of a series of home defense shotguns. So today... I've got a gun here that I think all of you who loves a cool home defense shotgun is going to enjoy. I'm going to be reviewing the Mogul, Emperor Mogul Ultramarine 12 gauge semi automatic shotgun from Emperor Arms. And this is one nasty looking dude. It just looks like he's got a major attitude problem. But that's what I like. I like a bad attitude. 
This shotgun is chambered for either two and three quarter or three inch shells. Emperor Firearms is a Turkish company that was created in 1962. This is a company that was started by a family who shared a passion for firearms and a desire to produce an inexpensive, high quality shotgun. Since their inception, they have produced magazine fed, over and under, tactical shotguns, which is the category that this Mogul Ultra falls in, and they also produce pump action and single shot shotguns. So shotguns has been their specialty since 1962. This will be my first time shooting this shotgun. It is on loan to me, so I could do this review for you guys. So thank you to my brother from another mother for trusting me with your beautifully mean, attitudinal looking shotgun. This thing just looks like it means business, which is one of the reasons why I thought it would be a great shotgun to start off my series of videos featuring home defense shotguns. So let's take a minute and check out the specs on the Mogul Ultramarine 12 gauge shotgun from Emperor Firearms. The Mogul Ultramarine comes with an extra stock if the pistol grip is not your thing. As shown here, the overall length is 32 inches and it is a non-NFA shotgun. It has an 18 and a half inch barrel that is chrome lined barrel. The receiver is a 70-75 T6 aluminum that is aircraft, aircraft grade and anodized. It has a standard trigger with a push button safety. The handguard is black synthetic and it has a capacity of four plus one with three inch shells. It has a front fiber optic sight and a rear sight that is fully adjustable. And by design, it is a great home defense shotgun. I'm gonna be shooting some two and three quarter inch double up buck from Fetter Ammunition. I don't have, unfortunately, any three inch shells here with me today, but this Fetter double up buck has been some really good ammo. And if it runs without any issues, I have some birdshot on hand, so we will have some fun with that. Let's get through the Fetter double up buck first and make sure we got no problems with the semi-automatic feeding. Well, I've introduced you to the shotgun and I've told you what I'm gonna feed it. Now it's time to let this bad dude eat. I'll see y'all back here in a bit for my final thoughts. And let's go smash something and hopefully it's not me that gets smashed. Let's go. So we got the old Emperor Arms Mogul Ultra. That is a mean looking dude, man. We're gonna load him up and get started. And we're gonna be shooting Fetter two and three quarter inch, one and one eighth ounce double up buck. Hopefully it'll run it good and we won't have any issues. I have always been a, uh, had a, I've always had a love for shotguns. Being raised in Delaware and where I used to do a lot of hunting, we're full. The weapon of choice was shotgun because you could not hunt anything with a rifle. So 
I learned, I, you know, everything I did with hunting and shooting, I learned with a shotgun. And um, as I've just gotten older, hasn't changed my love, uh, the love I have for them. So let's have some fun and let's show this thing some love. Hopefully it shows me some love and doesn't break a wrist or an elbow or whatever. I'm getting old, so I'm a little brittle now. We'll find out. So of course, as you can see, we don't have the extended buttstock. We have a pistol grip, which means when you aim these, uh, I got some comments in one of the last videos I did with the Mossberg, where somebody was like, you called me Hollywood because I was shooting from the hip. And I'm like, dude, it's a pistol grip, okay? Uh, you can still aim these really well and be pretty accurate with them. You don't have to be looking down the sights. If you have instinctive shooting skills at all, see the target, it is a scatter gun, point the target and you pull the trigger. Real simple. So nothing Hollywood about it. Let's sling some. And we are clear. Now that's 10 yards. Double up buck shooting straight from the hip. Who says you can't be accurate? I beg to differ. Still at 10 yards. Loaded up five more rounds of the uh, Fetter double up buck. Straight from the hip. Very nice. Loaded up with five more rounds of Fetter Double Up Buck. Still gonna keep it from the hip at 10 yards. So far we're doing okay with accuracy. Uh, don't seem to be a problem. And the gun seems to be running really well. So passing the home defense shotgun test so far, I would give it a, an A plus. Let's sling these five and then uh, maybe we'll try to run a few uh, bird shot out of it, see how that does. Well, I'm safe. Smooth as butter, people. Smooth as butter. Wow. Nice shotgun. And here we've got some bird shot. We've already got four loaded in. And uh, this is low brass, low brass bird shot. So it is one and one eighth ounce, two and three quarter inch. We're going to see how it does. Hopefully it'll run. Um, I get a little, I get a little nervous when it comes to gas fed semi-automatic shotguns. Um, simply because they, they usually like the, the higher velocity stuff, but we wouldn't know unless we try. So we're going to load this up with five rounds and we'll see how it does. Nothing like a 12 gauge boom stick. Oh Lord. Bird shot. Ran like a champ. Boy, this is a bad dude. I'm impressed. I really am. Let's load it up again. More bird shot. 
actually ran very nice. Let's go again. Man, that's nice. Shoo. Nice shooting gun. I think we load her up five more times, and then uh, as long as I can continue hitting the paper, like I haven't had a problem yet, you know, can't be accurate here, right? Come on, man. We have three loaded up already in the gun. Loading back up with the Fetter double up buck. Figured it'd be a good way to finish it off. And we're going to do it again, shooting from the hip. Because that's what I like to do. Man. What a bad dude. Whew. I hope you all enjoyed this video as much as I did making it. This is our first installment of a few left to come of home defense shotgun videos. And as far as I'm concerned, we're off with a bang. This is, this is a cool shotgun. Really enjoyed it. Bubba. Thank you, brother. Um, always appreciate you loaning me a, a weapon uh, to get out here and smash some stuff with it. I appreciate it very much. So I'll get her cleaned up, get her back to you. But guys, if you come across a Mogul Ultra or any, I would say anything from Emperor Arms, very economical, very, very reasonable. I mean, just reasonably priced. Um, and this thing performs fantastic. It really does. Uh, don't hesitate, man. Do your own research about them. If you get a chance, find one, pick one up, and see if it works for you. I think they're pretty daggone cool, if you ask me, and they're well-built. Well-built. So, with that being said, I hate to do it, because I love you, but I gotta go. Emperor Arms. Mogo. Ultra, semi-automatic 12 gauge, bad dude, real bad dude, big nasty, said the kennel for my final thoughts, yep, looks like Hollywood to me. Look, Tammy, I didn't even hit a clip. Welcome back to the kennels for my final thoughts on the Mogul Ultramarine semi-automatic 12-gauge shotgun from Emperor Firearms. I don't think there's a whole lot left to say that hasn't been said already. This shotgun speaks for itself. It's a great shooting shotgun that seems to live in the realm of beast mode. The recoil is not too bad, and if you're looking for a new or used home defense shotgun, then I think this gun is a great option. Remember, this is just the first video I'm doing in this series of home defense shotgun videos, and I hope you guys check them out as we are uploading them all to the channel. But most importantly, I hope you enjoy them. That's what this is all about. And don't forget, if you're interested in any Dog Pound t-shirts, we have them available now for sale, so follow the information here in the video uh, to, to get you to the right place that you need to go to pick yourself up a pretty cool t-shirt. And all of the funds that we collect from our merchandise sales, it all gets recycled right back into the channel so that we can keep doing these cool videos and having fun with you guys and keep this thing alive and moving forward. So we truly appreciate all of your support. And please don't forget to smash that like button on this video. And if you don't mind, 
Smash that subscribe button so you get notified of any new content that gets uploaded to the channel. I really need your guys' help to ensure that we always have a place to go so we can share our passion of firearms and a love for our freedoms. Thank you for being a part of our Doll Pound family. Thank you to our product sponsors who helped make these videos possible. Steel's Gun Shop in Lewis, Delaware for always being a friend and a huge help to me since the beginning of this journey. Give them a call or stop in and see them if you're in their area. They will take great care of you and help you find whatever you may need. And if you do, tell them that them dog sent you and you saw them here on the Dog Pound. Thank you to Splatterburst Targets for supplying us with these very cool targets we use in all of our videos. If you don't have a place where you're able to shoot steel targets, you might as well shoot some of the best paper targets on the market today. All of their targets are made right here in the land of the Stars and Stripes, so you will be supporting a homegrown business. Check out their website and get stocked up for your next trip out to the range. Thank you to our friends over at Ballastall Multipurpose Cleaner and Lubricant for all they do to help me out. Why trust anything but the very best to protect and preserve our precious tools of freedom? They are the original COP and they've been doing it since 1904. So you know they're doing something right. Check out their website for a complete lineup of their products and get stocked up today so you're better prepared for tomorrow. As always, spend time with those you love and care about. Time spent with them is always time well spent. May you live as long as you want and never want as long as you live. Shoot straight, shoot often, be safe, and God bless you and yours. I'm M Dog, and I'll see y'all right here next time on the Dog Pound. Emperor Arms, Mogul Ultra, 12 gauge, semi automatic. Look at that. Look, a big old bumblebee beehive. That's what they in mind. Remember, old choke tube beehives. But it's a bad dude. And it's getting chilly out, so. Me and Big Nasty, we gone. Boom.